You have entered the last period of a season that is finishing on December 31, 2023. However, this is not the only aspect of this season to come to an end. There are a few things that is finishing to in your life. Your activities, however you probably won't understand it, certainly stand out of the glorious heavenly messengers. You are accidentally doing great things, and each step you take is being seen by the heavenly. Dear Chuzaman, this isn't simply an irregular message. Three holy messengers are profoundly drenched in examining your life, your decisions, and the way that lies ahead. You are not simply one more individual meandering through life randomly. You are somebody extraordinary, and these heavenly messengers have directed your moves toward get what they are discussing you. You are intended for significance. You have a special reason, and your heavenly messengers are very much aware of it. Assuming you pick in their direction, you have proactively set out on the difficult excursion of otherworldliness. The profound ways requesting, requiring penance, discipline, and persistence. But, you have shown steadiness in any event, when confronted with apparently difficult difficulties. So for what reason are these divine creatures discussing you? This is on the grounds that you stand near the very edge of a significant change in your life. This period and this season are coming to an end. Something truly exceptional in your life is reaching a conclusion, and something new is about to unfurl. The heavenly messengers are working steadily, setting you up for this groundbreaking stage. You may be genuinely regretting the progressions ahead, however it's fundamental to comprehend that whatever occurs, happens just fog it. The heavenly messengers stand close by, going about as guides, directing you towards your predetermination. They need to observe your prosperity. Your flourish in the life implied explicitly for you. The heavenly messengers see inside you a light that sparkles more brilliant than any obscurity, an end that beats with adoration and sympathy for all creatures, a brain that is sharp and inventive, and a spirit that is unadulterated and untainted by the world. You are more than you could understand. In the not too distant future, you will have to say goodbye to some aspects of your life for good. The principal heavenly messenger talking about your appearance, she notices the reflection of your spirit, reflecting on the development, difficulties and winds that have formed you. She is murmuring of the significance of mindfulness and the insight acquired from reflection. Notice, for in understanding your excursion, you open the keys to your own development. The angel is referring to your mind's power, your spirit's resilience, and your heart's strength. This boldness in you that once uncovered will appropriately push ahead. Likewise, the subsequent holy messenger or the heavenly messenger of delivery is tapping forward with gentle and elegance as she urges you to relinquish the weights that burden your soul. Accept the freedom that comes with letting go of what no longer serves you and let your spirit soar unhindered into the awaiting dawn by beating old ones, self-doubt, or outdated patterns. In conclusion, the third heavenly messenger who is a holy messenger of restoration, broadening her brilliant wings as she messengers the up-and-coming appearance of another section in your life. The old is gone during a time of rebirth and new beginnings, and the new grows in its place. These changes are reflected in the cycles of life, and you can embrace the divine alchemy of transformation that moves in the cosmic symphony. Keep in mind, your steadfast confidence, rugged soul and your readiness to have those in need have not slipped through the cracks. The heavenly messengers perceived that you have done an amazing job, forfeiting such a great amount for other people without anticipating anything consequently. In any case, what is about and in your life are things that never again serve your greatest reason. All titans, 
propensities and ways of behaving that have kept you down for a really long time are coming to their decision. The fields and questions that have obstructed your advancement are disappearing. You have conveyed the heaviness of the world on your shoulders, battled through fights also, strived to get a handle on everything. The heavenly messengers recognize the weight you have conveyed, the battles you have confronted and the fights you have battled, the discuss your versatility and assurance, accentuating that you have confronted extraordinary moves but keep on standing tall. For you know it, for the heavenly messengers will be there to direct you through each troublesome time, through this message. What is encouraging you to believe that your future will be absolutely brilliant? This is a time of resurgence, when each seed planted against you by the foe will be reimbursed in full no matter what. Take on it and let your soul be loaded up with trust and anticipation. Faith is now this substance of pains hoped for, the evidence of pains not seen, as Amos chapter 11 once stated. You might have been strolling through the murkiness for a drawn out period, yet presently you can see a flicker of light not too far off. This shift, this change is something you can feel in your bones, in your spirit and in your way you being. You will soon emerge from the shadows and enter the light as something stirs and changes. At the point when the end at long last comes and the fresh start sun rises. You will think back on this second with appreciation and wonderment. You will come to the realization that every challenge, hardship, and average challenge you have encountered along the way was essential to your development, education, and development into the person you are today. So hold on tight, of faith, and know that your self-destructive and restrictive behavior will soon end. At the point when it is, you will step into another world, another reality. It will be more lovely, more supernatural and more awesome than you might have at any point envisioned. So how about we invite the new season, the new year for certain sure assertions and with this request. See this request now. We come to you, God of light and love, with thanksgiving mindful of the childish creatures that watch over us. As we stand nearly the last period of our excursion, our hearts stand to you in supplication, looking for direction from the insight of three heavenly messengers. Holy messengers of reflection, enlighten the reflections of our spirits with your delicate light, award us an insight to observe the examples inside our encounters. Our mere guidance took us on a journey of self-discovery, enabling us to comprehend the significance of each change and the development that comes from it. Holy messenger of delivery, we hold nothing back from your presence. Land is the solidarity to relinquish what no longer serves us. Injuries from way back, fears and connections. As we give these weights over to the infinite breezes, perhaps feel another telephone delicacy, willing to accept the endless possibilities that lie ahead. Give us the ability to release with grace and acceptance by teaching us the art of surrender. Holy messengers of restoration, we invite you for a cross-developmental excursion, for your unfathomable energy, tokens of the timeless patterns of life and direction through the holy course of re-establishment perhaps rise up out of this last stage with souls restored, prepared to leave on another section. Award us the boldness to explore this excursion with effortlessness and flexibility. We acknowledge the dance between the celestial and earthly ranks as we pray to the divine creator. Mistakes for your heavenly light and assist us with adjusting to the common murmurs of these holy messengers fortify our purpose as we approach the closing days of this extraordinary excursion, ingraining us a profound truth and heavenly arrangement. In your unfathomable love, we give up our feelings of dread, expectations and dreams. It is petitioning God stand as a demonstration of our resolute confidence in the pendulum powers that guide us.
as we step into the obscure, with the gifts of reflection, delivery and restoration, we are directing lights. Amen. Out every one of the individuals who have come this far paying attention to this heavenly message, may God and his holy messengers hear your every request and answer them promptly in animals exquisite name.